You know what I'm saying? Today, I'm gonna be showing y'all niggas how you create your own size chart. Whether it's pants. Dog! Can y'all even see? Dog! T-shirts. The little stitching. You see the stitching? From this stitching to this motherfucker stitching right here. You gonna measure from here to here. Measure from here. It's all on and everything. Y'all probably like, y'all niggas don't even need to watch the rest of the video. Whole bunch of size charts. <laughs> I just realized I'm at Walmart and I left my wallet at home. So now we gotta drive to Target, bro. God damn, bro. Walmart need to get Apple Pay. Lame mayonnaise, nigga. Let's go to fucking. Let's go to fucking Target, bro. God damn. Ah oh, shit. Look at these slow ass niggas walking in front of me. Slow ass niggas. <laughs> going to target now um what is popping youtube i don't know if this is my intro but if it is then what is good with y'all young boys man it is your boy dra back at it again with another banger like always you know what i'm saying today i'm gonna be showing y'all niggas how you create your own size chart because a lot of y'all been asking me dming me hey bro you got a size chart hey bro how you make size chart how you find size charts i got you bro don't even worry about it i always come through you know what i'm saying today we're gonna be talking about how to make or i'm gonna be showing y'all how to make a size chart for your clothing man, whether it's pants, t-shirts, jackets, shit, socks, nigga, underwear. It don't matter. I'm gonna put you on how to do it. So, first things first that we about to do is we gotta go to Walmart in a few. Not Walmart, nigga. We're gonna Target. Because Walmart, I don't have my wallet. But you can go to Walmart, Target, wherever you want. But we're gonna Target because I don't have my wallet. And yeah, but you already know how it goes, man. Before we get into this video, man, go ahead and hit that motherfucking like button. I think I might need a racist lame ass nigga. Hold on. You nigga trying to race? He ain't trying to race? You ain't trying to race? You ain't trying to race? You ain't trying to race? That nigga ain't even trying to race for real, y'all. But, um, yeah, before we get into this video, y'all already know how it goes, man. Y'all make sure y'all go in the comments down below. First off, comment something. Then I want you to like that motherfucking button because it's motherfucking free. Hit that subscribe button to join the DRS because we are on the road probably to 30K now by the time y'all watching this video. We should hit 20K by the time we, I post this video. So more likely on the road to hit 30,000 subscribers. I appreciate y'all so much. Everything y'all been doing. And for the last video, I went crazy. And yeah, um, like I said, we headed to the motherfucking Taj Jetta to get the equipment. And so yeah, I'm gonna pick out the camera once I get there. Mm. Yeah, I'm about to do it, so yeah. All right, y'all, so we got what we came in here for. I'm saying you got to get yourself a little tape measure. I lost mine that was at the crib, so I had to. Now, I ain't even lose I ain't gonna lie. That bitch got dirty as hell, and you can't even see the numbers no more. So I had to come get a new one, you know what I'm saying? So y'all could really see what I'm talking about. So get your cool little tape measure. That shit like $5 at motherfucking uh, Target. Probably like cheap at Walmart, but we got that. These niggas about to close, so they like kicking me out low key. This is like 800, the lens like 400, and then it's like 400. But it's really, for this right here, the kid lens is like 800 altogether. You trying to start YouTube? Yeah. Go crazy, bro. Just stay consistent, though. I mean, I don't know why. Yeah, it's the, it's the, yeah. I kind of started, but like, I don't know where to start at first. What you mean? Like, I don't know, like, what to post, like, what's good stuff. What you like? Different. Everybody. I mean, I like doing vlogs. They're vlogs. But you gotta, like, it's about the title. The title gotta be, like, 
helping people. You gotta help people first and then get into vlogs. Cause nobody just gonna watch you for no reason. Help people first and then vlog. Or vlog while helping people, that's what I like doing. But stay consistent though, for sure. All right, y'all niggas. We just got the motherfucking tape measure. You know what I'm saying? Now we finna get the hell out of here. I ain't even gonna lie. I don't know if y'all peeped, but a young nigga got shorts on, bro. It's getting hot as hell outside. Shout out to my boy, Josh, for the hoodie, man. If y'all don't check out his brand, you really tripping. Cause he one of the best hoodies out. No cap. But I'm gonna give y'all a little start up. A little quick start, you feel me? Got that bit right here. Sing, bitch. Sing, bitch. What the fuck? <laughs> Sing, bitch. Sing, bitch. Bro. Sing, bitch. Hey. I don't know why, y'all, but that shit be doing that sometimes. Like, if any of y'all are Mopart fiends, for my Hellcats and my Trackhawk niggas, who know everything about these motherfucking Moparts. Bro, DM me a comment down below. Why the fuck is it that sometimes when I quick start, that bitch work? And sometimes it don't fucking work. I don't get it. Cause look, I need y'all help. Y'all niggas be knowing everything about these motherfuckers. We just gonna manually start this bitch, I guess. Cause they motherfucker don't wanna cooperate with me and shit. You feel me? So we just gonna motherfucking start that bitch normally. Okay then. You yeah, hear me? Man, I'm gonna keep it a buck. This is so random cause it's not part of the video. But I just got this car like what? I think a week ago? Something like that? Twin. I fucking love this car. I literally want to track our already. Who the fuck is this bitch? Bro, who is this lame man nigga? Bro. Like, what the fuck? But nah, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I just got this car like a week ago. And I'm not gonna lie. If y'all don't know, this is a SRTG, right? So it's basically like a baby track hop. You could almost say, right? Bro, I already want to track hop. I kid you not. Nigga, I already want to track hop. I don't know, y'all. Like, what month are we in? It's April. Don't be surprised if y'all catch me in a track hog by like August, by like my birthday, cause my birthday is August uh, 17th. So I don't know y'all. Don't be surprised if you see me in a track hog, cause I love this car so far. And I want something even crazier, no cap. And I also want an E30. I ain't gonna lie, I want an E30. It's either I'm gonna go track, or I'm gonna keep this car and get an E30. So y'all stay tuned for that. But I would say, I need to do some mods to this bitch. You know what I'm saying? We got some stuff we gotta do to this car. Also, y'all go subscribe to my channel, my uh, car channel too. Go subscribe to the car channel because if you're not subscribed you real life bugging out and yeah uh that's enough fucking talking bro. i'm gonna pick out the camera when we about to get into this motherfucking 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 thing you know what i'm saying because y'all niggas is here for size truck. so guess what we gonna talk about motherfucking size truck nigga you feel me so yeah but go get a measuring tape if you don't have one um if you got one and shit let's go on to the next step bruh y'all look at this bro y'all look at this bro so I'm sleeping last night. I'm having a beautiful sleep, bro. You feel me? And then I hear, boom, bow, ugly. I'm like, I ain't know what it was. But then today when I woke up, I was like get, taking, the, I was about to take a shower. I walk in the closet, twin. Oh, the shelf is done. Bro, the shelf is GG, bro. Dog, this is the second time, bro. Y'all look at this. And then look at the top. Look at this one. Bro, this motherfucker about to fall. Are you serious? This is about to fall, bro. And if y'all look over there, if y'all look closely, there's like holes right there. I don't know if y'all can see it because my camera not focusing. If y'all look really, really closely, there's holes over there, bro. There's holes all around there because this has happened before. And there's holes down here too. There's two. You see one too because this happened before. But yeah, my shelf completely fell. So now we got a little mission we got to do after I show y'all how to do these size charts. So y'all stay tuned in the video, but now what we about to do is we finna get our measuring tape that we just bought from uh, Target or wherever you buy it. And I suggest you get you some sweatpants or some pants in general. Get you some pants, get you a t-shirt or a hoodie and get you some shorts, you feel me? It's really all gonna like all work together. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm gonna show y'all what I'm talking about, but just get you what you finna basically make. Get you what you trying to make. So if you're trying to make some pants, get you some pants. If you're trying to make a shirt, get you a shirt. If you're trying to make a hoodie, get you a hoodie. If you're trying to make a jean jacket, get you a jean jacket. You feel me? Let my fucking do that. Uh, I need a five t-shirt. I like this shirt. This shit fit me fine. So we got this shirt right here. Hee! Okay, we need, we need, we need some pants. Pants. Put my pants up, bro. Oh, they right here. Broken, nigga. On a damn broken shelf. Boom, we got some pants. Bam. And then what was the last thing that I said? What was the last thing that I said we needed? Pants, shirt, shorts. Hello, Nick. You need some shorts. I bet. Damn! Man, I'm coming. Get the shorts. All right, now get your measuring tape. You need a flat surface, so let go. Mm -hmm. 
You heard that thought? Oh, glad. That's my nigga on TikTok, B. Now, I'm really finna show y'all how they be on TikTok. Watch, watch, watch. This is how they be. This is how they be on TikTok, y'all. Let me show y'all how they really be. Things be like this. I know y'all heard that thud. I like, heavyweight. I know y'all heard that thud, though. I like, nigga, you better start slamming that beat like that. Y'all niggas better start. Y'all better start slamming it like that. I know some of y'all watching, too. Y'all be doing that, too. Stop slamming the clothes like that, bro. We get it. It's heavyweight. You ain't gotta, you know, relax. Relax. Now, let me stop playing with you. I'm so sorry. But let's get on the floor. Ah, this is such a weird angle. I ain't gonna lie. But we got the clothes, you know what I'm saying? First, we're gonna start with the pants because I feel like a lot of people be wanting measurements to pants. And niggas be gatekeeping. You feel me? So I'm gonna put you on to the pants one first. So uh, first thing says what you wanna do is you wanna get the pants and put it as flat as possible to the floor. Make sure the floor is flat because you don't wanna mess up any little tiny measurement, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, put it on the floor. So that what we about to do right now. I feel like I should put a better angle so y'all could really see it. Cause like, you feel me? Like I want y'all to get the best angle. You feel me? It's all about the angle. You know what I'm saying? It's all about the angles. All about the angles. Bro, wearing chunky shoes make my feet, my legs look so skinny. I mean, I know I got skinny legs. Don't, don't, don't be in a motherfucking comment, comment to some bullshit. Cause I'm gonna really smack the shit out your lane, man. All right. So I'm gonna move this right here out the way. Ooh, man. Ooh, man. Ooh, man. Now we got this. Now we finna get the pants. We're gonna get the pants. And we're gonna throw the pants on the floor. Bam! You wanna make sure everything's straight though. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm I'm squatting a little weird right now, but bro, don't be weird in the comments, bro. Now yo, you wanna get your measuring tape, so go ahead and open this motherfucker up. The lighting good, the lighting kinda too bright. I'm gonna open this up. Damn. Oh, this shit came with like a little box. Came with a box. We gonna open this up. This is what we need right here. You feel me? This little one right here. What the fuck? This shit too small. Yo, relax. I know I'm not tripping. Hold on. Why does this look so small, bro? Did I get scammed? Dog, bro, look at how small this is. What the f bro? This don't even fit the pants, bro. Bro, look at this, bro. Dog, can y'all even see? Dog, the numbers don't fit the pants. Oh my gosh, bro. Hold on, bro. I gotta figure something out, y'all. This, bro, this y'all only go to 40. Bro, do y'all see this? This y'all only go to 40, bro. Bitch, stop focusing on my face. Y'all never see, but this y'all only go to 40, bro. It don't even fit my pants. Bro, you serious? All right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do the shirt first. I ain't even gonna trip about it. We're gonna do the shirt first, y'all. Let's, let's, all right, let's do the shirt first. Let's get to the shirt. Let's get to the shirt. All right, so we got this cool little tee right here that I really, really mess with. Throw this on the floor like this. Make sure it's straight, though. Y'all gotta make sure it's straight, perfectly flat on the floor. You feel me? Don't ask me where I got this shirt, by the way. A lot of people be asking me where I got this shit at the thrift store, so I don't even know what the, what the actual brand is. But, boom. The shirt looking spiffy, iffy, clean on the flowy like these. Hold on, let me move it away. Bam! Let me move it away. Bam! Let me move it away so y'all can see. Bam, bam. So on the t-shirt, right, there's really four things that you want to measure. You know what I'm saying? Depending on what kind of t-shirt you want to make. But me personally, I do four things. You know what I'm saying? I wrote it down. You want to get a book or something like that or a piece of paper, a note or something to write it down. But I do, if y'all can even see, I do let, shoulder, chest, and what the fuck does that say? Sleeves. That's the four things I measure when I make my shirts. You feel me? That's the four things you want to measure. So first, the length is obviously... From, I'm gonna show y'all. Let, let, let me show y'all. I ain't even gonna talk. Let me just show y'all. Let, let, let go, let go. First thing is length though. Let's go, let's do the length. Uh, so length, you wanna go with the big numbers, by the way. You wanna use the big numbers, by the way. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be it's gonna be the little numbers that are the smallest centimeters, I think it is. And then there's gonna be the uh other side. I forgot what it's called, but just go with the bigger numbers. Go with the bigger numbers. So boom, you wanna go ahead and go from the top right here next to the neck. You see right here? You wanna measure from here all the way down to the length of the t-shirt. So boom, let me show y'all what it's looking like right here. Golly, it's hot. Boom, as y'all can see, it went down all the way to 32 and a half, 33, somewhere around there. But y'all see where I started at? The top right here, all the way down, all the way down to that motherfucker says this number right here. And then boom, all you're going to do is write this number down. So that's what we about to do right now. So boom, you're going to come to the motherfucking paper or whatever. You're going to come to your paper. You're going to go to Lent. You see where that motherfucker says Lent? I know your ass was kind of slow in school, but I need you to listen over here. You know what I'm saying? I need you to listen. Listen to me, nigga. Listen to me. Go to length. Boom. You gonna put whatever number. Me personally, I'm probably gonna put 33. Boom, we got 33. Don't talk about my handwriting now. I'm writing standing up. Nigga, calm down. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, I look like, I look like I, 
<laughs> I look like I ring doorbells right now. I look like I ring doorbells. Sign up to my club, nigga. So you wanna put 33. Boom. Now we finna go to shoulders. Like I said, next now we finna do shoulder. We got length. The length is 33 on the T, you know what I'm saying? And also make sure you write it down what kind of t-shirt it is, like the size of the actual shirt you're measuring. Right now what I'm measuring is a large. So on top of it, I'm gonna put a large. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put large and I'm gonna put the length of the large t-shirt that I feel like I want my brand to kind of like have. You know what I'm saying? So boom, we got the length 33. Now we gotta do the shorter. Let's go to the motherfucking shorter, nigga. Pate, we're back on the flow. Boom, make sure the shirt flat. Like I said before, I'm gonna slap the shit out of you. Now I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just kidding, bro. Relax. So make sure the t-shirt is flat like I said, y'all. And then you want to get your measuring tape again. Move up to the top. From here to here, this is your shoulder. From this, y'all see the little stitching? From this stitching, I'm gonna show y'all. So from here, right here, the little stitching, you see the stitching? From this stitching to this motherfucker stitching right here, you gonna measure from here to here. You feel me? Let's do that motherfucker right now. All right, so boom, put this bit right here. You see it? And then we gonna move the other one to right here. So that's about 22, no, goddamn 20, 22.5. Or 20, yeah, 22.5, that's literally what it is, 22.5. Nigga, I just got slow for a little bit. I'm gonna show y'all. Boom, start from there. All the way down to right here, okay? You see, it's about 25. We just go 22.5. So what you want to do is come on down to your motherfucking book, get your pencil. You go right down on the shoulder section. Boom, 22.5 ski. We got 22.5. We got 33 on the left. Now we gotta do the chest. Now look, the chest is from here to here. You feel me? What did I say? Let me show you again. Let me show you again. From here to here, basically right under the armpit, right here. From here to here. You know what I'm saying? Let's get on the floor and do it. Boom. From here to here. Now, y'all, usually the chest is going to be about the same thing as the shoulder. You feel me? Because it's kind of like, that's what I'm saying. But the chest is usually going to be a little bigger. You feel me? Just a little bit bigger. So for the chest, like I said, from here to here. You know what I'm saying? So boom. I got the chest done. As you can see, we got that motherfucker going from here to motherfucking here. And I'm going to show y'all what it's looking like. So as you can see, that motherfucker started right here. Went all the way. All the way. To right over here. So we're going to say like 24. Because y'all can see the thing is kind of, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of messed up. So I'm going to just round it up to like 24. Yeah, 24, like 23, 5. 23, 5, 23, 6. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to say like, you know what? I'm going to say 23. I'm tripping. I said 23, not 22. So I'm going to say like 23 chest. We're going to put 23, 5. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like an inch bigger than, not an inch. Yeah, like an inch more than the motherfucker. It's kind of like an inch more than the shoulder. Now we got to do sleeves. Let's do the sleeves. So boom. We on the sleeve section. We gonna do here. You see it? Hold on. Let me let me back you up. Here to here. You see it? Boom. We go. Bam. Bam. Nine. Y'all see it? That motherfucker says nine. Y'all niggas cannot see it. Hold on. You see it? Bam to motherfucking bam. That motherfucker says nine. Nine inches, nigga. So you wanna come over here? Mm. Get the hoes. Sleeves nine. So now we got the t-shirts. Next. We gonna do pants. Now I'm gonna do shorts, cause remember the shorts, my, my pants, the the, 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 the the thing is not long enough. But if y'all see how I do the shorts, you gonna know how to do the pants, you feel me? So make sure y'all get a longer one than me. We just gonna do the shorts, you feel me? We gonna do the shorts. Let's do, let's do the shorts. All right, shorts. Shorts, y'all heard that thug? Ugly. Oh, <laughs> shorts, let's do shorts. All right, so you wanna make sure the short the short straight, like I said, you know what I'm saying? Make sure everything looking straight, you feel me? Boom, y'all nigga, come here. Okay, what up twin? Look down. Okay, nigga. So boom, get your tape measure. You feel me? We're gonna do this, we gonna do the uh the length first, the length of the shorts. So the length is from here to here. The length of the shorts, you feel me? So length. Get your measuring tape. Boom. Bam. So we're looking at about, let me show y'all. For the length, we're looking at about 16.2. So we're looking at about 16.2 inches right here. Can y'all see? We're looking at about 16.2 inches. You see it? Boom. Bam. I'm gonna put 16.3. So get your book. Why is that book over there, bro? Come here, nigga. Come here. Watch this, y'all. Watch this. Ooh, I bet y'all niggas can't do that one. Y'all can't do that one. Nah, for real, open it, open it up. Boom, we're back on the page. Why is the pencil over there, bro? God damn. Come here, nigga. Come here. So boom, length of the shorts. Let me put length right here. You feel me? Length 16.4. 
I'm gonna put four. I just rounded it up 16.4. Now we gotta do the waist. The waist is very, very important. Make sure you get the waist right, bro. Make sure you get the waist right. So now we're on the waist. If y'all don't know what the waist is, it's right here. You feel me? This right here is the waist. You know what I'm saying? So boom, for the waist, get this once again. You know what I'm saying? Boom. You measure from here to here. Now it's about 11 inches. You know what I'm saying? 11 inches across. So it's more likely gonna be 11 times 11 because as y'all can see, it goes in circle. The whole waist is in circle. You know what I'm saying? Depending on the manufacturer. So the whole waist is in circle. So you go ahead and say 11 times 11, 22. So we can go ahead and put 22 inches, but I'm gonna put 11 inches because I just need the, just the line. You know what I'm saying? Not the whole entire thing. So we're gonna put all right over here, 11. Cool, now we gotta do the inseam. Now if y'all don't know what the inseam is, it's basically like, bro, that shit gonna be so awkward. I'm not even finna show y'all right now. It's, it's, it's like the V on your thigh area. You, 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 let me show you, let me show you, let me show you. Boom, this is the inseam right here, y'all. You see the V right here? This the inseam. So each person inseam is very different on shorts. Mine are very short, cause I like short, short. So it really depends on you. But me personally, I like the short one. So if you wanna copy mine, go ahead. This is a size medium short. So, so boom, we gonna do the inseam. Get the tape measure, measure from here. You know what I'm saying? The end of this, end of the crotch part, all the way down to the shorts or the end of the shorts. So boom, get this, we got six. Six inches. You see it? So these shorts are six inches inseam. Y'all see it? Boom, six inches. And six inches is usually really, really good for short shorts. So we got six inches. Boom, we write it down. Where you at? Inseam, six inches. Next, we got the leg opening. Let's go get that leg opening. So the leg opening would be from here to here is the whole leg opening. You get it? It's a leg, like the, the leg. I hope you get it. Leg opening. So what you're gonna do is move it, bam, all the way down. Bam. So we got about, we got about 12, 12 point what? Where we at, twin? You let me know. We got about 12.4, 12.5 for the leg opening. So we're gonna put 12.5. And boom, just like that, you got that. Same thing you're gonna do for the pants, because as y'all can see, my, my, my tape measure was not that long, so I can't really show y'all the pants, but you're gonna do the same thing for the pants. But for the pants, you don't need the inseam, and you don't need the leg opening. This is what you're gonna do for the pants. Y'all just seen how I did the waist, y'all seen how I did the length, and y'all seen how I did the leg opening. So for the pants, this is exactly what you're gonna do. Same thing I just did. So for the length, you're gonna go from here all the way down for pants to the ankle. You feel me? That's the length for your pants. For the waist, you're gonna do from here all the way across for your pants. And that's really all you need for the pants. You don't really need inseams and all that. You really don't need leg opening unless you wanna make really, really baggy pants. Then I'll suggest you do leg opening. Y'all just seen how I did leg opening. You go from here all the way across. All right, y'all, so boom, now you know how to get the t-shirt, you know how to get shorts, and you should know how to get pants with this. You know what I'm saying? I just put you, I really just put you down. So all now you need to do is figure out the sizes for each size. So you probably like, what do you mean by that? So obviously the item that you're using right now is more than likely a size, medium, large, extra large, small, extra small, shit, double XL, goddamn double extra small, I don't know what you're using, right? More than likely it's them sizes, but when you have a clothing brand, you have to sell every size. So now you need Need multiple sizes you need to do this with multiple sizes what I would suggest you to do is go three sizes down of each thing so for example for the t-shirt I got 33 right here right I would probably go to 29 for the length you know what I'm saying for a size small the t-shirt that I measured was a size medium really it was a size medium but it's a baggy t-shirt you feel me it was a size medium and it went to the length of 33 so for a small I would probably do like 29 for the length. you know what I'm saying I'll lower everything like probably five down for an extra large or a large, I'll probably lower everything five up or three up, depending. Now, I would say this though, I could help y'all out. It ain't gonna be free though, you know what I'm saying? Cause I'm not gonna give y'all every single thing that I do cause I had to put in the work to find it and do the trials and errors. So, if y'all want a size chart list, y'all go ahead and follow me on Instagram, DM me on Instagram for my, for my size chart list and I will sell it to you. Right? Because I know size charts are really, really hard to find. Y'all don't understand. I had to figure out my own size chart. Depending on certain pieces, I had to figure it out. Some of them I found it myself. Some of them I find them online. Like if you look it up online, you will find it. But it might be a little, it might be a little uh, hard to find it. You feel me? But if you do want a whole entire size chart list and you don't want to do all this stuff I just did, nigga, hit me up in the DMs. I will save my size chart. I got flared. I got flared size charts. I got pants slash charts. Damn, I can't even say that word. I got flared. I got flared size charts. I got flared size charts. I got t-shirt slash charts. Baggy t-shirt slash charts. The vintage ones. You feel me? I got the jeans slash charts. I. I can't even say that slash charts. I got the hoodie slash charts most definitely. And then uh, I do have short slash charts, slash charts too. So if you, slash charts, goddamn. If you want to hit me up for that, y'all go ahead and hit me up on Instagram and I got y'all. But if you don't want to do that, this is a way you can find slash charts. I basically just showed y'all. Just like I said, when you find a slash chart for the specific item you have 
in your hand. So if it's a medium, just lower the size down probably three or four or five, you feel me? Just depending or, high, or make it higher, you feel me? If you got a small and you want a size medium, boost it to like three sizes each on each level, you feel me? So maybe make the shorter, three more length, three more uh, chest, three more sleeves, three more. And then, you know, if you want to be smaller, make it three less. If you want to be super duper bigger, make it six more. Make it six more than the length of the piece you have. I hope y'all are understanding what I'm trying to say. But yeah, you could do that. Or if you really want to be weird, not even weird, if you really want to be determined, bro, because this is something I would do. Nigga, take your ass to Walmart, take your ass to Target, go get your t-shirt that you like, that looks like you would like how it fits. You know them niggas be having hell of them in stock. Twin, grab four. For them motherfuckers, take your ass to the damn goddamn what? I'll be empty, bro. Take your ass to the mechanic. I'll put them bitches on the floor. Bring your measuring tape. Start measuring. What you mean? We gonna get it regardless. You know what I'm saying? So if you don't want to buy my size chart list and you don't have like different sizes or you don't want to be just doubling the sizes because you want it to be super duper specific, bro. Take your ass to Walmart or Target. Get four of these shirts each size. Go to the back. Put it on the floor and measure it, bro. We gonna get it regardless. I'm keeping it above. I'm just keeping it above. That's something I would do. If I want something, I'm gonna go get it. So, hey, if y'all want to do that, I ain't gonna lie. That is a smart thing to do. No cap. So, yeah, y'all. That is basically how you find a size chart. Now, y'all know how I be in these videos, bro. It's like every time I film, I got something to do. I always got something to do. So, uh, like I just showed y'all a second ago. If y'all come with me. This happened. Did y'all fail? So, I have to go to Ikea and buy something because I have hella clothes, y'all. And I keep getting more and more clothes because y'all send me stuff in the P.O. Box, which I really, really do appreciate so much. And I also got something else in the P.O. Box that I got a notification for it, but I wasn't able to go over there. But either way, that's besides if I'm going to go tomorrow. But y'all know I got hella clothes and y'all keep sending me fire, fire clothes. So, I got to do something with this closet, bro. Like, like this is the second time this happened and I can't keep going through this, bro. I got clothes on the floor. I'm a bro. If y'all don't know this about me, I have OCD. So, when places is too dirty and mis disorganized, bro, I can't, I can't beat up for that long. So what we gonna do is, is we finna get dressed or just throw on a hoodie back on and take our asses to Ikea and buy some shit to fix this. Cause God damn, this ain't it. This ain't it right now. So with that being said, y'all give me a second. I'm finna, I'm finna get dressed real quick and get spiffy iffy. You know what I'm saying? All right, y'all. Little cold start. It's the cold start of the day. I haven't even started the car all day. All right. You know what I'm saying? Having a white car, bro, it's gonna get dirty. I just had a car wash yesterday, bro. Y'all look, that ass had a car wash yesterday. Look, bro. Look at this. Y'all see this, bro? Like, bro. Bro, I'm not making this up. Like, I dead washed the car yesterday, bro. Like, yesterday. Yesterday, not two days ago. Not three days. In fact, I did wash the car two days ago, too. But I washed the car twice in four days. Bro, like, having a white car is not it. So, hey, I'm trying to figure out what color I should wrap my car. So, hey, y'all drop in the comments down below what y'all think. I'm thinking, like, I'm really thinking, like, all black. Because that's just my vibe. Like, all black. Or, like, a crazy color. Like, a bright-ass, like pastel color i don't know but bro what the f what the f bro dog can't make this up bro can't make this up. i think that's the only thing i don't like about this car is the fact that it's white the white complements the car it makes you look cooler but that shit just get dirty too quick but we about to head to uh, kia real quick it's 7 32 they close at 9 and that kia is a cool 30 minutes away from me plus that motherfucking atl traffic Man, that shit about to be crazy. So, enough speaking and talking. We about to head to Ikea. Damn! So, I got about 40 something minutes before they close, bro. That's crazy. That drive was something else. I need to name my car, y'all. What y'all think the name should be? I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments down below. I'm thinking it's really it's really the D, the DR mobile shit. But I don't know though. It's really the DR mobile in my opinion. But if that shit lame, y'all let me know in the comments down below. But we about to go in this motherfucker right here and get the damn shelf. Cause what the fuck happened in my closet? I don't know.
bro, if y'all ever been to Ikea, bro, that shit is so fucking big for no reason, bro. Like, Excuse me? Uh, do you know what a, a wardrobe shelf would be at? Yeah. You have a wardrobe from Ikea already? Nah. I don't. Um, well, the wardrobes are customizable. For real? Yeah, so I'm not sure if you can find shelves that match, I guess, what you would need uh -huh. as a measurement wise. But if you check the bedrooms department, they can let you know. Okay, bet. So go back towards the elevator. Uh -huh. It's a tarped area. Go through that area. Okay, thank you. Man, I don't even know what language she just spoke. Talking about as my wardrobe customized. What's it? What, bro? What, bro? What does that even mean? I don't even know what that shit mean, bro. I don't even know what that shit mean, but she said go to the bedroom section, and I don't know where that shit at. Excuse me? You know where the wardrobes will be at? Yeah, it's like right, right around the corner. Okay, thank you. Oh! Huh? Are you about to design a wardrobe? I don't even know. Somebody just told me I gotta like design it or something like that. Right. I'm the only person at the apartment. Uh huh. Okay, bet. I'm gonna just look at him. Okay, bet. What the fuck? So you got to design wardrobes, y'all. Did y'all niggas know you got to design wardrobes? Because I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I thought you just got to like, I thought they had something pre-built. You know what I'm saying? Like, what is this, bro? Honestly, I found some. I just need something like this, bro. Like these. I feel like it's just perfect. Like, I don't even want nothing too crazy. I don't even want to hang shit up. I think I have to. But something like this would be fine. You feel me? I could put my clothes. I don't know if my hoodie, my hoodies can't fit on here though. I got some shit, I need some shit to hang. See like these, we got the hoodies right here. We got the tees right there. We got the pants at the bottom. You feel me? Like, I just need something like this. Like, I don't want nothing too crazy. Oh, this one's slick better. I ain't gonna lie, this one's slick better. You got the shelves at the top and then it got these spots right here I could put clothes in. I like this one better y'all. I ain't gonna lie. This one's slick good too, but that shit big as fuck. I don't need nothing too crazy, too big. You know what I'm saying? She said she went on break, bro. So I ain't gonna lie. I like this one too, but this shit big as fuck. <laughs> I don't know if I should just leave because she said she going on break. And it been closing like 30 minutes. What you going on break for if it's closing in 30 minutes? So I don't know. We might just have to do this shit another day, bro. Meaning I kind of drove over here for no reason. I don't know. Damn, bro. I guess we about to go home, bro. I just sped over here for no reason. Shorty talking about she going on break. Nigga, it closed in 30 minutes. What break? You're going home. All right, y'all. So, um, I'm scared. I got a random African-American dropping okay, hold my on. car. I'm scared. Oh, shit. I got to move my car. No, you don't, nigga. Back up. Just back up, nigga. Back up, nigga. No, it's indestructible. You can go through your car. Exactly, nigga. It's a boat. If you wanted to get on, put it on track if you need to. I don't got my glasses. Oh, oh my man. God. Just, hey, turn this on. Press it a little bit up the, up the hill. <laughs> Who drove this here? What the fuck you mean, nigga? <laughs> no, I'm talking about like to the neighborhood. You right? <laughs> what the fuck? I know, I know, because I didn't know the you know, fake cars. You know, you know, what the fuck? fuck? Scared too. <laughs> oh God! What are y'all scared for? You know I'm a good driver. You should be no, scared. Fuck. This nigga driving his shit. Now he's scared. I've never crashed. Oh lame man. You can put it on track, but please. Not in the neighborhood. I'm gonna fuck around and crash this bitch. Uh, click the button over there. Click it. Click it again. Click it again. Press it. Press it. Press it. Press the gas. <laughs> Press the gas, nigga. Uh, uh, nigga, hold the gas, nigga. <laughs> What the fuck? Yeah, you just woke your whole neighborhood up. <laughs> Alright, click uh click the right one. Just keep clicking it. I'll tell you. Yeah. Just hold it. Hold it? Yeah, and then let go. Chill, let me try back. You gotta hold my camera though. W content! W I had w no motherfucking content, bro. Yeah, hold on. Let me let me throw my let me throw my belt on. Y'all know I just in the middle. I wanna get your reaction to it. We're gonna die. You should probably put your seat. What are you finna do, bro? I don't believe in seatbelts. Oh. All right, y'all. So she just turned me on. I'm gonna get the nigga reaction to it. To the to the wit. You gotta hold it. Yeah, hold yourself. Dude. Oh my god. Hold yourself. You know what I'm saying? You ready? Let us like be comfortable. Right, I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nigga, take me over, bro. <laughs> I'm done. Bro. Yo! Air. No, you're gonna catch air. You got it too. Ray, you're gonna catch air. <laughs> Hold on to the seats, Chris. No seat, fellow. You're a hood as fuck. I'm used to this shit. <laughs> Imagine, yeah. first day, I'm sitting here like these, and Ray's just doing that shit. I'm like this. <laughs> we did Yo, catch it. I, I ain't gonna lie. We did catch it. He's gonna pass out. All right, we gotta go. Uh, this shit is so tough, bro. Shit, that man. I thought you wanted to get a Tesla though. I did. You did? Yeah, but fuck I, the Tesla. In fact, did not put this. I mean, hey, that's all I want to get in both one day. That ass. Oh, God. You know, what's what's your, I want an E30 next. What is that? BMW. BMW. Mm. I think I know what you're talking about. An old school one? All right. So, it's like the next day for real. Y'all can't even see me. All right, y'all. So, it's the next day. You feel me? I'm about to go to the post office because I got to ship some stuff. You know what I'm saying? But we here. I just wanted to show y'all my fit, cause why not? You know what I'm saying? It's like kind of a fashion channel, so like Scotty Brand, so like Whoopi Whoop. So ignore the fit I got on right now, though. Chill, but I'm gonna throw this one right here. Cool look, pants. Man, <laughs> I'm gonna throw this on. It's like summertime, or the summer coming up, or it's hot outside. So we got there right here. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm gonna throw these on right here. If y'all know. If y'all know that, y'all know. If you know that video, then you know the video. Show the chain, and boom, this really the fit. Show you how to fit real quick. This dead the fit of the day. No cap, it's the fit, y'all. Nothing crazy, bro. So we go Dior Marnies. We got these pants right here. They kind of look like Balenci's. We go Dior T. We go chains a little bit, you know what I'm saying? And then we go hat at the top. I'm gonna take my hair off, obviously. And yeah, this the fit, bro. Hey, go ahead. I tell y'all bro i literally filled this car up yesterday last night bro like i fill this car up every day bro i mean i drive a lot i ain't gonna lie like i be driving like 40 50 minutes away from the crib but like damn nigga like i gotta fill it up every day Ah. 
What's poppin', my boy? Alright, y'all, so it's probably like, I ain't gonna lie, it's probably like two days later. Or actually, it's a day later. I did go to Ikea, and y'all saw, uh, they was about to close, so I was like, forget that. I'm gonna have to figure something else out with my, uh, closet. I'm probably gonna show y'all, like, in another video or whatever. But, I was thinking, right? I did teach y'all how to make a size chart, but I was like, bro, I was gonna sell y'all my size chart, but it's like, man, I ain't about to make y'all go through all that. So, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just put y'all on on how I actually found my size chart. You feel me? So, with that being said, go get your computer, you know what I'm saying, or screenshot. You might as well start screenshotting because you ain't even got to do the lookup. I'm doing it for you. You might as well start screenshotting. I'm going to show y'all probably three different size charts. I'm going to show y'all flare pants because a lot of people like making flare pants. I'm going to show y'all hoodies and I'm going to show y'all t-shirts. These are personally my size charts. Like, these are the ones that I use for my clothing brand. So, you know, it depends on what kind of brand you want. Y'all know I like baggy clothes and a lot of people be like... I don't like baggy. Like I posted a TikTok with these sweatsuits. It blew up and everybody talking about some dumb baggy ass clothes. Dumb baggy, and bro, I don't care. I like I like baggy clothes. So I'm gonna show y'all what I like. If y'all don't like it, then you know you can kind of like change the size chart or whatever. But if you are into the type of clothes that I like, the baggy look and all that, then you can use mine. So with that being said, hop on the computer, man. nigga. All right, y'all. So you wanna go ahead and go on the Google, man? Hey, that's so crazy, isn't it crazy? I had this profile. I mean, this wallpaper right here, cause I was manifesting this, and I dead have this now. But I just gotta change the colors. Oh shit, it's, I'm dark. But yeah, I just gotta change the color of my car to this. This is really the rap I want. You wanna head to Google and we gonna go, first place that we gonna go, like I said, we doing flare pants first. You wanna go to Minimal, Minimal. Go to Minimal. Y'all know Minimal, right? Like the, the website, Minimal, the clothing. Yeah, go to Minimal. Once you get to Minimal, man, we finna go to Bottoms. So boom, as y'all can see, they already got the flare pants right here. You feel me? Like they got, I think these are like three different kinds of, or they're all the same. These are all the same flare pants. Cool. I personally did this flare pants right here, so you wanna click it, and then all you gotta do, bro, go to size guy. Boom. You got you got your size chart. That that's simple, bro. That is that simple, bro. Like you don't need. Honestly, of course you could do what I said by like measuring everything because it would kind of be smarter for you to measure everything because you just see it in hand and you kind of know what you're working with. Or you could just go buy some minimal flare pants. I mean, I know they be taxing with their flare pants or $68. They do be taxing, but I mean, hey, if you really, really want to know what it's like, this is the exact size chart I use for my flare pants. So if y'all know what my flare pants look like for my clothing brand, this is the exact one, bro. This exact one. No cap. Why are these niggas calling me? Hold on. <laughs> I was supposed to go hoop with them, so I'm trying to finish this video up. But anyways, like I was saying, this is the exact flare pants uh, size chart I use right here. I do have a medium, like my size is a medium, so I usually pick a medium as y'all can see, 32 inches, 13 and a half on the waist, you know, whoop de whoop. Y'all see it all. So for flare pants, I suggest y'all use this size chart. I don't have, like if you want a more slimmer fit, I don't really know where you're going to get that at. I don't know where you get a size chart like that. But if y'all do like the baggy flare pants kind of look like basically my size chart, get you these. You know what I'm saying? Boom. Now you got your flare pants. Let's go on to the next. Back to what I was saying, now we gotta go get the hoodie size charts because I know y'all want them hoodie size charts. But for the hoodie size charts, you wanna go to Rue Porter. Boom, here it is, Rue Porter, luxurious brand, whatever, whatever. This place too have like regular sweatpants size chart, they have shirt size charts, they have um girls crop hoodie size charts, but they got everything on here. So you wanna go over here and then you wanna go to men's, I mean, for me personally, you know what I'm saying? Depending on who you are, you're probably going to pick something different. But we doing me, you know what I'm saying? We doing for, for the guys, you feel me? The females, y'all basically do the same thing. But y'all just go to the girl section. Duh, nigga. Duh, you feel me? So for the hoodies, boom, you want to go to the hoodie. They got this heavyweight hoodie right here. Click it, go down, size guy. You see this? Boom. But they patched it? Hold on. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way, boy. We finna find it, chill. Y'all give me a second. Trust me. Dog. Ah, I found it. <laughs> Look at that. So I had to go to the shirt section. I had to go to like the t-shirt to find the size chart. But this is the root port of size chart right here. As y'all can see. We back. 
Okay, so cool. This is the hoodie size charts right here, y'all. As y'all can see, it's gonna be like more of a heavy, like not a heavyweight, but like a bag. Let me show y'all. This is a medium. I have it on actually. This is a medium right here, and as y'all can see, this is the hoodie. You know what I'm saying? That's that size chart right there. So it's kind of like it's not like it's baggy, but it's like it cuffs on you. You know what I'm saying? So it's like baggy, but it cuffs on you. So if y'all want that, this is the size chart. If you scroll down, they got the uh, crew neck size chart as well. Same thing. It's really the same thing, but you know, one have a hood, a hood, so it's like really the same thing. You feel me? So you could use this size chart for the hood, for the hoodies, the crew necks. Boom. With that being said, let's go on to the t-shirts. You want to go to Shaka Wear. If y'all know, then y'all know. Some of y'all know, some of y'all don't. You want to search Shaka Wear size chart. Go to their website, and then boom, you're gonna see a whole bunch of size charts. I ain't gonna lie, these niggas are hella size charts. But me personally. I only like their t-shirt size charts. I don't look at nothing else. Like, I don't care about no tank top that they have right here. Y'all see? Y'all see this? Y'all see all the size charts they have? Really? I ain't gonna lie. Really? Shockerwear is the place to go if you want any size chart. I just kind of put y'all on and everything. And y'all probably like, y'all niggas don't even need to watch the rest of the video. Y'all don't need to do nothing of what I just said, honestly, after seeing this right here. They have everything, bro. As y'all can see, you got the mesh shorts. They got the vest. Come on, bro. They got the vest. So for the t-shirts, these are the t-shirts that I personally like. I like this one right here, the Max Heavy Garmin Dye. Cause it's like, it's it's like a heavy tee. Kind of like this, let me show y'all. I don't know if y'all can tell, but it's basically like these. It's a heavy weighted tee. It's heavyweight. And it's kind of like baggy, but it fits you correctly. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's the type of t-shirt I like. So if y'all like that, go ahead and screenshot this or go to the website. Use this one right here. You know what I'm saying? Got the size chart, got the sizes. Boom, everything looking good. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got the mesh shorts, summer coming. Up, you know what I'm saying? Y'all better get started with the men's short. I got the cargoes. They got cargoes right here. Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. Jump, bro. Jump a like for the video. Jump, the, jump, the, jump a like on this video, bro. Can, can we can we drop a like on this video? I just put y'all on to the heat. So yeah, I just put you on. I ain't gonna lie. I just put y'all niggas on. Hey, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna come through every time. I'm gonna come through every time, man. So yeah, y'all. That is basically how you find size charts. I decided to show y'all more in depth because I know. The measurements is cool, but sometimes not all of us really want to do that. <laughs> you feel me? Like, I didn't want to do that shit when I started. So, I was like, I'm going to show you another way. So, this is the second way. is by just looking at different websites and different, like, pieces that you like. Like, you could really probably go on Rick Owens or something like that. Look up the side shot. it probably pop up. Look up Louis Vuitton side shot. it probably pop up. So, it really depends on the kind of look you want. But if you really, really want to go in depth, I do suggest you measure it with a measuring tape. Go to denim. I don't know what their denim look like. I mean, it's straight. Go to size chart, boom, you got the denim. You know what I'm saying? You might need to change it just a little bit. Personally, for denim, I will say go to Levi's, bro. Levi's be having their size chart. Go to Levi's 501s or something like that. Look up their size chart, use that one. Cause I don't really know much about Chocolate denim. They look good, but Jonathan's fit is not hitting right now. Like Jonathan, why is your laces over your shoe? I mean, why is your, your laces over your jeans, bro? Especially dumb shoes. Your shoes are dirty. The fitting of this is just not hitting your shirt tucked in. I know you're trying to show the pants, but twin, why are you standing like that, bro? Why is Jonathan making me mad, bro? Jonathan, you gotta, he gotta model this better, bro. Like, they gotta model, like, they should've put one with the shirt over it so we could really see, like, the proportions and, you know what I'm saying? But, hey, boom, you got the sign shirt for denim. Like I say, you can go to Levi's.com, look up their side shop for denim, and use that. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, y'all. So, yeah, y'all, that is basically it, bro. Now y'all know how to find side shot. I put y'all on how to measure the side shot or how to measure your, make your own side shot. And I really just put y'all on how to find side shot. So, yeah. Hey, now you know what to do, bro. Now get your ass to work. Don't be sitting over here watching all these videos talking about, oh, shit, I just learned something new. Oh, my God. And then you finna turn the video and go watch some bullshit. Nah, get up and go on that computer, go on that iPad, go on that phone, go on that damn notebook that you be drawing your stuff on and get to work bro it ain't no time to waste we gotta create we're creators on this channel bro like i just realized that about myself like i'm dead a create no 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 bro you're lying oh i'm tripping y'all i was looking i thought I, I ended the screen record before i was done but anyways y'all like i was saying bro we're creators on this channel bro so we have to constantly be creating bro like, I ain't gonna lie, something about me, bro. Like, I just realized if I'm not constantly creating, bro, that shit could turn into a depression. So, constantly creating, bro. Creating, bro. Get your ass up. Let's go. Get up. Don't sit on that bed just looking at this video like, oh, this is so nice. I know how to do this now. And then you finna be like, oh, I'm gonna do it tomorrow. Nah. Get up. 
your soul crave creating. So get your ass up and let's go. So yeah, y'all. Um, anyways, I don't know if this is the end of the video, but if it is, thank y'all so much for watching this video, man. Y'all already know how it goes, man. Make sure you go ahead and smack that like button because it's more hooking free. Hit that subscribe button and join the DRS and turn that post notification on to be notified when your boy posts. Cause if you still not be notified, you really Bangin' out, y'all know what I'm saying? DRS to the motherfucking top, and we ain't gonna motherfucking stop. You know what I'm saying? I love y'all, I love y'all, I love y'all so freaking much. And yeah, um, that's if that's the end of the video. If not, then y'all be right back. You heard?